Hello and welcome. I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another. I want to say not trailer reaction review because it's not a trailer, but this is definitely a reaction of the Game Award nominees for 2024. I'm hype. I'm hype. Let's see what the Game Awards is going to bring us as far as the nominees are concerned. Hopefully, we get some good uh, Game of the Year nominations so we can get a good... Uh, what's the thing where they do with the music at the end of the year? I think that's always phenomenal and it's good when there's great games to go alongside that. I hope Astrobot don't get snubbed. I hope Echoes of Wisdom get a nomination. Marie gets a nomination. Um, what else did we play? Uh, Star Wars... Um, Outlaws might get snubbed, but a lot of people didn't like it. I did like it. Why is it low? Goes to. Okay. And the winner is. And the winner is. I feel like it's still low. Let me double check. Is that me on that site? Is that my site? A journey together to celebrate video games as the biggest, most powerful form of entertainment in the world. And on Thursday, December twelfth, right here at Peacock Theater in Los Angeles. We will recognize the best. Yep, I'm at 100. Show you what's next with the 10th anniversary of the Game Awards. Hey, everybody, I'm Jeff. Hey, hey, hey. welcome to the TG hey, Jeff. Global Nomination Announcement Special. Today, it is my distinct honor to reveal this year's nominees, oh, no. recognizing talented game developers yeah. from studios big and small around the world. And you can help select the winners by voting right now at thegameawards.com. Okay. Right. You've waited long enough. We're going to do Let's that right after. We're going to do the votes, too. nominees for the Game Awards 2024. Okay. Nominees. For best ongoing game, the Fortnite. nominees are <laughs> Destiny 2, Diablo 4, okay. Final Fantasy 14, okay. Fortnite, Fortnite, and Helldivers 2. Oh, Helldivers might win. best performance Fuck. nominees are Brianna White for Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. Hannah Tell for Life is Strange Double Exposure. Don't, didn't play that game. Umberly Gonzalez for Silent yes! Outlaws. Best performance. Luke Roberts, Silent Let's Hill win two. one. Let's win one. Melina Jurgens, Senua Saga. Let's get LK one two. for Star Wars. <laughs> for the best mobile game, the nominees Pokemon are... Pokemon Trading Card the Game. The Journey. Bellatro. Oh, Bellatro Mod. Oh, but Pokemon, Pokemon is there. Let's go. Waves. And... Zenless Zone Let's Zero. go. Pokemon the is for there. Best art direction are best art direction. Astro, Astro! Wu Kong, Elden art. Ring, Shadow oh. of the Earth Tree, Metaphor, Refantasio, and Neva. Neva. For best, best art story direction, music, might be Neva. No. This year's nominees are but, uh, Astro Astrobot. Yes. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Yes. Metaphor, Refantasio. Did play it. Silent Hill Two. Okay, and I can see that. Stellar Blade. In the category and the of music, best audio actually, design, these games are nominated. So Astro there's something. Bot, yes, Call best of audio design. Black Ops 6. Yes, Black Ops Final 6. Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. Senua's Saga, Hellblade 2. Of course, that, that probably Silent is going to win. Two. Oh, even best Silent Hill 2 might, might win that, actually, and authentically though, audio. Shows, movies, and other creative endeavors based on video game worlds. Here are this year's nominees for best adaptation. Arcane. Fallout. Knuckles. Knuckles. Like a Dragon Yakuza. And Tomb Raider, The Legend of Lara Croft. Mm, Fallout is definitely going to win, game, right? The TGA Fallout got that in the back. Final Fantasy VII Best Rebirth. narrative. Like a Dragon, Infinite Wealth. Maybe Rebirth. Metaphor, Refantasio. I don't know about Senua Metaphor. Senua's Saga, Hellblade 2. And Silent Hill 2. Nah, it's Metaphor. Uh, games for Final Impact Fantasy, celebrates thought-provoking games with a profound pro-social meaning or message. Here Astro are this Bot. year's nominees. <laughs> Games for Impact. Closer Astro to Bot. the distance. <laughs> right. Indica. Neva. Neva. Neva Life got Strange, that. Strange Double Exposure. Oh. Senua's Saga Hellblade 2. Yeah. Tales of Kenzo. Yes! Oh! The best community support are... Let's go! Gate 3. Let's Final go! Final Fantasy 14. Fortnite. Tales of Kenzo. Zao. And... No Man's Sky. Tales of Kanzara Zao. Let's go. The nominees are Best Call, Call of Duty, Duty Black Ops Best 6, Multiplayer, Call of Duty, L Divers 2, Super Mario Party. Oh my Party God, Jamboree, Mario Party! Dragon 8, and oh. 40,000, Space Marine 2. That's a tough pick. Best God, Hell Divers and a Mario Party. of risk tolerance as they are produced outside of the traditional publisher system. The nominees Best are Best Independent Game, Animal Astropop. 
Elotra, <laughs> Lorelei and the Laser Eyes, Neva, and UFO 50. I don't know any. Next uh, is best debut indie game, which recognizes a development team that hasn't won a game award before. In fact, these teams published their first game in 2024. The best nominees first game are best debut Animal indie. Well, Animal Well, Elotra, probably over Elantra. Manor Lords, Pacific Drive, and the Plucky Squire. Oh, the Plucky the Squire got a nom. What? The are Arizona Let's go, Sunshine Plucky Remake. Squire. Then Asgard VR. I'm not a VR guy. Batman Arkham. Even Shadow, though Batman should win. Metal Hellsinger VR and just so Metro we could get Awakening. more Batman games for Content Creator of the Year. The nominees are who's the nominees? Queso, Queso, Techno Gamers, Typical Gamer. Oh, and Usada Pecora. Part of the Game Awards is looking forward to what's <laughs> no next. Yes, we'll no Kai Yes, we'll have speed. lots of games to announce on December 12th. But what's the most I think, anticipated uh, either typical game? Gamer Here are the or, nominees based um, on currently um, okay, announced so. titles. Death Stranding 2 on the beach. What's anticipated? Ghost of Yote. Grand, Grand Theft Auto. Auto 6. Grand Theft Auto. Metroid Prime 4. Oh, Beyond. Metroid. And Monster Hunter I Wilds. think Grand Theft Auto the 6. The best action adventure nominees are... Obviously. Astrobot. Astrobot. Yes, Prince. Prince. Silent Hill 2. Star Wars Outlaws. Yes. The Legend of Zelda. Yes. Of oh, that's a tough the category. Playing. The jury There's selected. a lot of games I like. Dragon's that one. Dogma 2. Elden Ring Shadow of the Earth okay. Tree. Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. Okay. Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth. And okay. Metaphor Refantasia. In the category okay. of best fighting, the nominees best fighting are Tekken is gonna get Dragon it. Ball Sparking Ooh. Zero, Grand Blue Fantasy vs. Rising, okay. Marvel vs. Capcom oh, Fighting Collection, I Arcade forgot this Classics, one dropped. Multi vs. and Tekken 8. Wow. The nominees for best action. Wow. Black Myth Wukong, Call That's of Duty Black Ops 6, thing. Best Action Divers 2, Call of Duty. Stellar Blade, and. Warhammer 40,000 oh, Space Marine 2. That's that that campaign innovation was in accessibility celebrates games that are making our industry available and enjoyable to more people. Selected by a special committee of accessibility experts, the nominees for innovation in accessibility. I need to get are, on this uh, accessibility Call expert of Duty Black list, Ops man. 6. I'm playing Diablo one arm. 4, Dragon Age the Veil Guard, Prince of Persia the Lost Crown and Star Wars. I was going to say Prince of Persia did a, good, a lot game. of um, the nominees thing. are Astrobot, Astrobot, Princess Peach, Peach Showtime, Showtime. <laughs> Super Mario Party, <laughs> Mario Jamboree, Party, The Legend of Zelda, Zelda Echoes, Echoes of Wisdom, Wisdom, and The Plucky Squire. Great. The best game. Sim strategy Great nominees are game. Age of Mythology Retold, Frostpunk 2. This is going to be hard for me. I played a lot of, of the those. Gods, I played all of those family Manor games. Lords and. Unicorn Overlord. This year, these titles are nominated for Best Sports Racing. Sports Racing? F124, EA Sports FC25, NBA 2K25, Top Spin 2K25, and WWE 2K24. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at our 2K, three esports categories. Starting with Best Esports Game. The nominees best e are game. Counter Strike 2. Dota 2. Not my game. League man. of Legends. These are not my Mobile games. Legends. Bang Bang. And Bang Bang. Valorant. The nominees for best esports oh, athlete is are there. Athlete. 3-3. Three, three. Don't know him. Alexi B. Don't know him. Chuvi. Don't know him. Faker. Faker. Zywu. And Kong Kong. And for Baker? the best esports team, <laughs> our special esports committee nominated these best teams. Best esports team. Billy Billy Gaming, League of Legends. Billy Billy. G, League of Legends. Okay. Navi, Counter Strike. Counter Strike. T1, League of Legends. And Team Liquid, Dota 2. Liquid! All right, it's time for our final two categories. Probably the best team, game direction, Liquid, which recognizes outstanding creative vision and innovation in game direction and design. The nominees are. Best game Astro direction. Bot. Astro Bot Blotra. for sure. Black Myth Wukong. Elden Ring Shadow of the Erd Tree. <sighs> Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And Metaphor Refantasio. Astro Bot. Best game direction. And Astro finally, bot. our game of the year. TGA jury, of which I am not a member, has selected the following six games as nominees for Game of the Year at the Game Awards 2024. The Game of the Year nominees are. 
Astrobot. Astrobot. From Team Asobi. Bellatro from Local Thunk. Wow. Black Myth Wu Kong by Game Science. Bellatro is Elden in Ring, there. Shadow of the Erd Tree by From Software. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth from Square Enix. And Metaphor Refantasio from Studio Zero. So there you have it. Those are your nominees for Game of the Year. And yes, that means you'll hear the Game Awards Orchestra, conducted by Lauren Balf, play their themes live on this very stage on December 12th. But before then, you should head to thegameawards.com. See, when we have games like Shadow of the Earth Tree get nominated, it knocks out the spots for other games to get represented. So we don't get Prince of Persia get nominated for Game of the Year, even though it's probably one of the best games of this year. We don't we don't get Echoes of Wisdom up there, even though it was a great game. It just feels like they should just have their own category at this point, right? Like we have three different esports categories, but don't have oh game of the year for DLC, game of the year, the best DLC of the year, the best remake of the year. Like Silent Hill Two is is not there because we get no 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 disc to Belantro, but we got a, a a card game, a mobile card game.